Hi, I'm Eric Dodds from Ruddersack, and we're going to talk briefly about the growth stack today. We wrote a guide on data maturity, and it covers the starter stack, the growth stack, the ML stack, and the real-time stack. As a brief review, the starter stack is all about consolidating your data collection into a single data layer. Instead of having all these different services installed in your website and app, collecting data in their own way and sending it through their own pipeline to their individual service, which creates data inconsistencies across all of your SaaS tools, the starter stack is really about consolidating that collection into a single data layer and getting consistent data in all of your SaaS tools. This means that your CRM is getting the same data as let's say your website analytics tool. This is a really big win for companies who keep running into inconsistent data across their different platforms. The challenge is that even though that helps individual teams work off of the same sheet of music in terms of the basic data that's getting into their tools, it doesn't provide you a way to look at all of the data across all of those tools. Usually the symptoms of needing a growth stack come when individual teams are using individual tools and any sort of comprehensive question that you want to answer requires exporting data out of individual SaaS platforms and trying to mung that data in a spreadsheet. That's usually a bunch of VLOOKUPs and takes someone a couple days. Anyone who's had to prepare for a board meeting or some sort of big presentation using all this data in a spreadsheet knows that that can be pretty painful. That usually becomes pretty acute at a company that's growing really fast or has reached a certain level of complexity in their tech stack. This is when you're ready for what we call the growth stack. The punchline about the growth stack is that you need a central repository for all of the data that lives in all of those different SaaS tools. That is the modern data warehouse or data lake. The good news is that today you can actually easily get not only all of the raw event data or behavioral data that's being collected from your websites and apps that's feeding all those SaaS tools, but you can also ingest structured data from your CRM tool, your marketing automation tool, your payments platform, and more into a single repository in your warehouse or data lake. This does several things for you. Number one, it gives you the foundation for a single source of truth for your company. All of the data from every system resides in a single place. That's huge. Second, it allows you to answer much more complex questions about your business. Because you're querying data across the entire spectrum uh, of your business, not just looking at a single platform. So the growth stack really is about moving from a point solution architecture, or maybe point to point integrations, and collecting all of your data in a warehouse or a data lake so that you can have a single source of truth and begin to answer more complex questions about your business.